crowded hall You see there's a beauty standing Is she really everywhere? Oh, a reflection One always calls out to you The other shy and quiet Could there be two different girls Who look the same as the sweet valley? I don't think I'll need it, Liz. Lila, Patty, over here. Come on. Hi. Elizabeth, I voted for you. That's nice to know. But I'm Jessica. Elizabeth's over there somewhere. <laughs> Sorry, you both look so much alike. Wow, I never noticed. Your sister seems to have cornered the nerd vote. Enid! How are you holding up? Okay, it's just kind of hard to be here without Todd. Don't look now, he's over there. Not now, okay now. Hey, Jessica, we still on for tomorrow night? As long as you voted for me and I win. Oh, you will. I voted for you three times. <laughs> three times? Nothing like school spirit. How many dates for votes did you promise? Lila, I'm really insulted. Man, I can't believe Liz broke up with me over such a little thing. All I did was nominate her for homecoming queen. What's the big deal? It's just too bad women don't come with instructions. He's been doing it for weeks. He's making all my decisions for me. I feel smothered. I wouldn't mind being smothered by a guy like Todd. You don't get it, Enid. On top of everything else, he put me up for homecoming queen without asking me. Why didn't you pull out? I tried, but the ballots were already printed when I found out. What's the big deal? These things are just popularity contests. They're so shallow. I'm so psyched to be homecoming queen. <laughs> You're not queen yet. Hey, now, who's the babe? His name is Scott Daniels. And check this out. He's a freshman in college. A college guy? Perfect. Jess, I don't think he can vote. It's not his vote I'm interested in. Hey, Elizabeth. I voted for you. Get lost, doofus. Oh, uh, sorry, Jessica. Everybody! Everybody, please! As president of the Sweet Valley Homecoming Committee, it's my honor to introduce some pretty fine-looking women. All right. And now, the crowning of our queen. Will it be Princess Amy Sutton? <laughs> Princess Elizabeth Wakefield? <laughs> or Princess Jessica Wakefield? Royal tunes, please. You got it. And this year's homecoming queen is. I love being me. Elizabeth Wakefield. Quite a surprise. I never really thought of being homecoming queen before. It's a great honor. I normally don't feel comfortable in the spotlight, but you've made me feel very welcome. Thanks. Right. And no queen would be complete without her king. And this year's honor goes to Winston Egbert. Next.
next to the time I kissed Lila Fowler in the third grade. This is the happiest day of my life. It never happened, I swear. As my first official decree as your king, I hereby declare that all laboratory rats are now free. Bruce, you're free to go. Oh, you the king! And now it's time for the royal couple to take the floor. Manuel, kick it. Okay, let's open it up. Who told you about those? Ew. Dance? You still mad? The fact that I won doesn't change that we still have a problem. I thought you were having fun up there. That's not the point. You just don't get it, do you? I guess not. Forget it. I don't feel like dancing. He's making a big mistake. Dance? Sure. I'm Scott. I'm Elizabeth. She gets homecoming queen Anna hunk. I'll never live this down. What do you think? Well, it's hack writing without any journalists. I'm talking about the ad. The new Wonder Bras. They can give cleavage to anyone. Jazz, quit obsessing about your body. It's the same as mine. Yeah. But if I just had this bra, it would transform my life. Get a grip. Hello? Yes, it's Elizabeth. Scott? Oh, sure, I remember. Scott from homecoming? Friday night. I... I don't know. No, no, it's, get, get, it's just I've sort of been seeing someone. Don't tell him. Yeah, Todd Wilkins. Give me the well, we've kind of broken up, but, you know, I just don't know what's... <gasps> Are you crazy? What is your problem? Oh, not you, Scott. Can you hold on a sec? What? You're not turning down Scott. But what about Todd? Todd's toast. Last I remember, he blew you off at the dance. Scott? Yeah, Friday night would be great. Sure, give me your number. Look at the eyes and ears today. Which star dunker and roving Sweet Valley reporter are no longer playing one-on-one? -on -one? Who writes this gossip anyway? Who knows? Come on, you work on the school paper. You must know. No, but I wouldn't want to be whoever it is. You know the tradition. I found out they get dunked into the pool. There's never anything about me in here. If I don't get a boyfriend by my birthday, I swear I'll run a personal ad in the Oracle. Shy, sensitive girl looking for Mr. Wright. Have car, we'll relocate. What would you write? Hmm. A hot single babe seeks meaningful relationship with anyone. Thanks, Liz. I'm placing that ad right now. Todd. Elizabeth. Hi. How's it going? OK, I guess. Great. Um, look, I've been thinking. I owe you an apology. Thanks. I'm glad you finally understand how I feel. Yeah, I should have danced with you. Todd, this isn't about dancing. Whatever it is, can we just forget about it? Let's go to a movie tomorrow night. I can't. I have plans. 
Plans? Plans with who? Scott Daniels. Fine. Suit yourself. Hi, Scott. Yeah, it's me, Elizabeth. Look, I thought it might be easier if I met you over at your place. Phi Gamma Alpha? I know where that is. Okay. See you tomorrow, Scott. <clears throat> You're wearing that? You don't like it? It screams librarian. Come on, Scott's a college guy. Lose the sweater. But I like this sweater, obviously. You wear it every day. It's so you. Here. This? You look great. Hey, you look like me. Now all you need is a bit of makeup. But I already put it on. As they say, practice makes perfect. Ugh. Amazing. Thanks. Sorry I'm late. I wound up having to get a ride. I'll get you home later. How about a drink? We've got everything. Wine, beer. Diet Cola? Diet Cola? Uh, I'll have to check. Forget it. I really love the way you move, Liz. Thanks. Jessica taught me everything I know. She's an awesome dancer. Let's take a break for a sec. I need another drink. I remember when you carved that. It was after the 4th of July barbecue at Fowler Manor. What are you doing here? Sometimes I come up here to think. Good memories. Yeah. So, what I'm your day with what's his face? Oh, I canceled it. He stood me up. What did I do that was so wrong? You took me for granted. That's crazy. No, it's not. You're always making all my decisions for me. The movies we see, the parties we go to. I thought we were a team. This is not a game, Todd. It's us. For our relationship to work, we have to communicate. We have to be equal partners. I didn't realize I was doing that. I guess I screwed up. Liz, you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. I don't want to be in a fight with you. I love you. I love you too, Tom. so cool. Yeah. We have one of these, like, every month. You should buy my twin sister Jessica next time. This is totally her scene. Great. Double my pleasure. No, I mean, you might like her better. All the guys at school want to date her. If she looks anything like you, I can see why. Yeah, but I'm, you know, conservative. And Jessica is more your type. I'll be happy to set you up with her any time. I'll keep it in mind. How about another drink? Sure. Then afterwards, there's something I need to tell you. Guys, you're not gonna believe this. I just found out who writes the Eyes and Ears gossip column. Who? Who? Okay. My sources are totally reliable. I just saw Ginny down at the mall, and her sister's boyfriend found out from this guy. I think he's on the swim team. Anyway, his girlfriend's locker is right next to Mr. Collins' office, and she said she saw someone we know hand him an envelope after hours. And Lila! Elizabeth, 
Wakefield. Oh, right. I'm sure she would write all about her and Todd. Please, wake up and smell the cappuccino. Mr. Collins' after-hours envelope. It's totally suspicious. Shh, shh, here she comes. Elizabeth, Todd, what are you guys doing together? Let's just say that things work out the way they're supposed to. <laughs> what did you have to do, kill Scott Daniels? I didn't have to. Scott totally flaked, and I'm really glad. He wasn't right for you anyway. Could I have his number? <laughs> Rumor has it you write the eyes and ears column. We've got it on a reliable source. Yeah, some guy on the swim team. Who may have a brother. Or was it a sister who lives in the locker down by the Oracle? <laughs> you guys are so dense. <laughs> do the Phi Gams throw a great bash or what? I don't know. I wasn't there. Sure you were. You're, uh, Elizabeth, right? Yeah. I met you tonight with, with Scott Daniels. She's been with me all night. Jessica. Jessica. I can't believe you're only 16. Why not? I don't know. You're just so mature. Drink up. What did you put in here? It's just a little rum. It'll loosen you up. I don't need to be loosened up. Let's just dance. You've been dancing. Why don't we go upstairs to my room and, um, talk? I don't think so. How? Quit it! I thought you wanted to tell me something. Forget it. You blew it. You're so high school, Elizabeth. And by the way, I'm not Elizabeth. I'm Jessica, jerk. I can't wait to see her face when I go in there. Speak of the devil. Leaving so soon? What happened? Scott tried to get me drunk, and then he grabbed me. Are you OK? I'm going to kill that guy. You're not helping, Todd. I just want to go home, OK? You haven't said anything to me all night. Look, I know what I did was wrong. I know I'm the world's worst sister, okay? But I am really, really sorry. Won't you say something? Come on, give me a break. Why should I? Hey, I did it for you. You didn't really want to go out with Scott. And if I hadn't, you and Todd wouldn't be together right now. You know, I never thought about it that way. Yeah. So you forgive me, right? <sighs> of course I do. I took care of everything. It's all set. Oh, yes. Nice outfit. Have a little pity, Jess. Let's go. <gasps> oh, my God. <gasps> I can't go into class looking like this. I'm sorry, Jess. Here. That sweater. Do it yourself. No. No, I'll wear it. Come on, we're gonna be late for class. Oh, I left my homework in my car. I'll see you at lunch. <sighs> Come on, there she is. Is. See you later, Liz. Come on now. Yeah. Yeah. What are you doing? You know the prize for riding the eyes and ears, Liz. But I'm Jessica, you idiots. Nice try. Jessica wouldn't be caught dead in that sweater. Gotcha, Liz. <laughs> Is she really everywhere? Or a reflection?